School is over. Exams are over. I'm back. Welcome to my channel. I'm back after two weeks of exams, school, stress, and terrible things, but now exams are finally over and they went really well, so that's a plus, and now I'm excited to get back into YouTube. Today I'm going to be doing a video that I've been wanting to do for a really long time, and it's the series that I will not be finishing video. I have six series to show you, so let's get started with the video. The first series that I will not be completing is the Daughter of Smoke and Bone series by Lainey Taylor. Now if you have been on my channel long enough, you will know that I did not enjoy this book at all. I thought this book was really hard to understand and the creatures were really just too complicated for me. And I know this is high fantasy and I love fantasy but I think this one was just too much for me for some reason. I feel like I'm the only person in this world who didn't like this book but it just how it is and I'm not gonna finish this series. I'm sorry but it's not gonna happen. The next series that I will not be completing is also a really popular series that everyone seems to like and the second book just came out but I did not pick it up because I didn't like the first book, and that is Rebel Bell by Rachel Hawkins. This book is about a southern belle who kind of just gets powers out of a kiss, yeah, and I didn't like it at all. For some reason, I did not like the main character, I did not like the love interest or anything in this book, and it was just kind of boring for me. For some reason, I don't know, I don't even know why. I read it last year and I just remember really not liking it. So yeah, I'm not gonna pick up Miss Mayhem, which is the second book or any book that's gonna be in that series. The third series in this list is kind of hard to tell you guys because a lot of you really, 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 really like it. And that is The Darkest Minds by Alexandra Bracken. I know, I know, don't kill me. I don't know why, but this book just didn't have any kind of big appeal to me. I read it, I enjoyed it, but it wasn't my favorite thing in the world. And at times I was really, really bored. The characters were really plain to me and I did not feel any kind of connection to them. So yeah, I am not motivated at all to pick up the second book or the third book. So, yeah, and they're also really chunky and big books, like this was like 500 something. Like if I have to read a book like that, I have to like it. I can't read a 500 page book and like be bored out of my mind while reading it, so not happening. The next series that I will not be completing, you already know if you have been on my channel long enough, because I have a review on this book, and you know how much I did, I just, just did not, could not even. And that is Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children by Ransom Riggs. I feel really bad because Ransom Riggs is such an amazing person. He's, he's a great person, but I just didn't enjoy this book. I mean, I thought it was gonna be like really scary, but I had really high expectations for this book and it really did not live up to them. Also, the pictures were was the only thing that I liked about it. Like, I didn't like the main character. I thought the love interest was just out of this world bad. It's, it's no, not, no. Mm-mm. So yeah, not completing this. I'm sorry. I have Hollow City and it's signed. So that's kind of a bummer, but... What can you do? The next series is the... Dune series by Carrie Corp and Lori Langdon. Now, I only picked this book up because of Sasha Ellsberg, obviously. She is queen, and so I had to pick this book up because she was so obsessed with it last year, and so I was just like, I need that book in my life. I read it, and it didn't work for me. For some reason, this book just didn't get me. It didn't appeal to me in any way. I didn't really like the characters, I thought, uh, especially the two main characters, uh, Veronica and McKenna, I think. They were really, really, really annoying, and I just can't cope with them. I read the second book in this series, and it was just even worse with the characters and how annoying they were. So yeah, I'm not going to complete the series. The third book is coming out this year, I think, and it's not going to go on my shelf. 
The last series is actually a graphic novel series, and that is Deadly Class by Rick Remender and two other people. Now, I read this book in May, I think, and I was like, I had really high expectations going into it. I was like, yeah, this is gonna be kick butt and it's gonna be awesome. Then it wasn't. The only thing I really liked about this was the art style. I just loved the drawings in this and, and they were awesome and the color scheme was amazing. But the story did not work for me. I mean, I don't think it's appropriate for people my age, especially with some things they do in this book, like drugs. Yeah. But I think if I was older, then I would have liked this book. I, it's just, it just wasn't for my age. I'm not mature enough to be able to read this without being completely traumatized. It wasn't traumatizing, it was just a little bit too much for me to, to handle, because I'm 13 and you guys know that. But yeah, I just didn't like this book, I'm sorry, so I'm not gonna continue on with the series. So there you have it, those are the series that I will not be completing. Comment down below if you share any opinions with me, if you really like some of these series and you want to convince me to finish them, because you could also do that, you know, it could change my mind. That's a thing. Thank you so much for watching guys, and I will see all of you next time. Bye!